Ooh, Arsenal already scored there. I'm just watching the Carabao Cup final between Arsenal and Man City, so by the time this video goes up, Arsenal have either been hammered or have come back uh, to win 2-1. We shall wait and see. Um, so, that's a hopeful for that. Anyway, back to Pokemon news. So, as you may have already hearing, there are rumours that Bulbasaur might be the next Community Day Pokemon. This was posted by myself last night on the Silk Road, and it has since received 33,000 views and a lot of mixed reactions. Some happy, some definitely not happy. A lot of people are hoping that maybe the other Gen 1 starters might be available and that Niantic might extend the event. So, we shall wait and see on that. I don't think they will go past three hours because I think Niantic like to break it up into time zones and not overlap it to uh, keep the servers running smoothly because a lot of people do actually get back to play the game once a month every Saturday now. So, we shall wait and see on that. Uh, game Rant and Every Eye uh, websites also picked up on this story. Um, the image was obtained by myself by looking at the current Community Day website and seeing how the Dratini image was saved and then replacing that with other Pokemon names. So I checked a fair few and Bubzor was the only one that had an actual image to its name and it was available so I posted that on Silk Road as you've seen. Um, it has since been removed by Niantic on their end so that can either mean that it is actually the Pokemon or maybe this image was just uploaded as a placeholder by the designer so they're able to um, finalize the layout and see how it would actually look but I think if they were doing that they would actually use the image without a Pokemon in the uh, iPhone itself so we should wait and see on that so um, we shall see. Hey, how's it going? So today has been pretty quiet raids wise here in town. We've only had from level one to level fours, uh, no fives unfortunately. Even with the change from Niantic, I thought a lot more level fives would be popping up. Uh, so we head down to the park to do a level two raid. Um, it is in uh, EX raid eligible gym. So we took that on. So hopefully in the coming weeks, we might get another chance at a Mewtwo and uh, hopefully catching it in AR plus. Stay tuned for that. So. We took our the Mawile on, it had uh, Astonish and Play Rough as its moves, and we took it on with our 100% Maltrays, so we're going to see how we get on now. So I'm just going to press play. So, in with our Maltrays, it was boosted, it was sunny weather, so the fire type moves were boosted. So we got a few quick hits there. And then, for whatever reason, just before the charge move, I do dodge and I do miss one quick attack, which maybe makes a difference at the very end of the raid. So we fire off our overheat there. We do get hit a couple of times by the charge move. So from here on in, we don't actually dodge any moves. We just straight tap. We do pretty good. So we're coming up to our charge move there. We get hit by the um, play rough. We fire off our charge move. Now here we're in a bit of trouble. Our health is lower than Mawel and our charge bar is quite low. And we're just going to get up to our charge bar now. We're going to fire off the charge bar. And we're into the red now on both ends. Unfortunately, Mawile comes in with a charge move again. Nearly knocks us out. So now we're in fierce trouble. We're, we're spamming our quick move. We get hit by the charge move, but thankfully just before that, we actually defeated the Mawile. With 119 seconds remaining, we actually start on 177, which is quite a good time. So a quick match is uh, 58 seconds it took to defeat it which is quite good. I think the world record for a verified video one is actually 57 seconds. So we're definitely gonna try it again. We came to the catch screen for Mawile and for whatever reason, I clicked run. I could have gone back for it, but um, I was actually walking out of the park on the way home for dinner, so skipped it, but it wasn't shiny. If it was shiny, I would have been running back. And um, we also had a shiny chance of a Magikarp, just pops up now, unfortunately that was a standard Magikarp, so. Pretty good to do another level two with just one Pokemon, so we can add that to our collection. So for now, I'll talk to you all soon. Thanks a for watching.